Yo. Yo. Praise to his divine grace, AC Bhagavadana Swami. I come like a tsunami, hit you. I hit you like a missile, I explode like electrodes to your dome. I'm in the place, in the in the space of the mind. Then I combine with the realm of the eternal. My name is Ryan Merkel, and I surf through the sound. The flow, you fall down, and it goes, and it goes, and it goes. Yo. Damn, you just made that up? Yeah, yeah. Really? Yeah, I did. <laughs> that was good. That was okay, right? That was sick. How you say it? Persona? 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 Yeah. AC Bhaktivedanta. Oh, wait. What was it? Bhaktivedanta Swami? AC Bhaktivedanta Swami. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, I kiss the feet of AC Bhavanta Sanas. Oh. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> Hare Krishna, I kiss the feet of AC Bhavanta Sanas. Oh, I can't even say it. Bhakti Vedanta Swami Rami. Srila Papa? How do you say it again though? Srila Prabhupada? Prabhupada? Hare Hare. I kiss the feet of AC Bhakta Vedanta Swami. I walk across the safari. I saw a giraffe and it saw me. With its head really long and it saw me. Then it warned the lions about me. My name is Ryan, I'm about to see the truth in its purest form. I enter the realm of. What is the place called again? No, it's where Krishna lives. Krishna's boat, what's it called again? Vrindavan? Yeah, Vrindavan. I enter Vrindavan, that's when I saw him, Krishna, he was blue, and all I could see was the truth, it was overwhelming to me, the only thing that I could see was pure radiance, my brain couldn't get it, my brain couldn't stand it, I couldn't stand next to him, I fell to the ground, with my forehead on the ground, then I started to say aloud, Lord Krishna please, accept my obeisances, that's when he said, okay just sit, let me tell you about all of the things that I know in this world and all the millions and trillions of worlds in the multiverses. That's when he started spitting sick verses. Krishna started spitting sick verses and it hurt him. It hurt me. It hurt everybody because his words were too pure. They were like arrows coming out in a million trillion directions. I saw perfection. That's when Lord Shiva came to me with his trident. He said, sit down and let me tell you where I've been. I've been to all of the millions and trillions and bazillions of worlds in the cosmos. I said, Shiva. Was that good or was that bad? Then I saw the foreheads of Brahma. I said, Brahma, why do you have to speak the Vedas? Why did you have to free us from the our enslavement? Brahma said, my foreheads, they spit down flames and truth. I said, Brahma, please tell me what you know. Brahma then showed me Ganesha's skull. It was the skull of an elephant. I said, Lord Ganesha, I know that you've been hell and back. Ganesha said, yes, I fought Shiva that one day. That's when Shiva cut off my head. I said, Ganesha, is it hard being the son of Parvati? He said, no, it's not, you see? Because I see so many things like that one time. 
when I saw the moon, Chandra, and it made fun of me while I was running and I fell. That's why Chandra has to turn from black to white and black to white. My raps are tight. I smoke crack tonight. No, I don't smoke crack, all right? Because I follow the 10 rules that you have to do. What are, the, what are those 10 rules called? Huh? What are those 10 rules called? I don't know. The 10 offenses. I was on the fence, then I got off of it. I said, I'm gonna put my whole life to this. I'm gonna surrender my life to Lord Krishna and say, Hare Hare, 16 rounds a day. This is all I have to say.